We are approaching a very important deadline for people impacted by Hurricane Ida. November 29th is the last day to apply for disaster assistance from FEMA. WDSU's Morgan Lent is live in St. Charles Parish where that assistance is really needed. Morgan. Yeah, Gino, we spent the day here in Luling where to be fair, a lot of progress has been made, but also to be fair, we're not back to normal here just yet. There are still blue roofs everywhere when you drive around town and a lot of people are living in campers or they're staying with family waiting for their homes to finally be repaired. We also stopped by a food distribution event hosted by Second Harvest and People's Health today. And everyone who came through that line is dealing with post Ida recovery. We met one woman who told us it has been frustrating trying to work with her insurance and FEMA. It's quite disappointing. You know, you have general contractors that come in and tell you you have $85,000 worth of damage and the insurance offers you $40,000. You know, so then you have to go through this process with FEMA and they tell you 90 days, you know, don't contact them. They'll contact you if they have any other questions. So it's, it's quite discouraging. You buy your, your dream house and you start remodeling it yourself and in an instant it's gone. And look, FEMA officials tell me they understand people are frustrated, but they promise they are working to process those claims. They say it's also so important that if you are worried your insurance is not going to cover all of the repairs that you need to make, then you should go ahead and apply with FEMA by Monday, November 29th. Reporting live in Luling, I'm Morgan Lentis, WDSU News.